Good afternoon everybody welcome to the channel once again here we are it's a beautiful day uh, just a little too warm the sun's out full force blue skies so this is what we're doing today I've made the decision that the Nikomat Nikormat FTN is going to be my main art camera film camera for art for black and white photography uh, I've got a few lenses for it now, there's a few more on the way and we'll slowly be collecting up the non-AI lenses for this camera. It's, uh, it, it, has, it has the ports, oh, I'm having a hard time holding it up here. It's got a plug-in port for the uh, flash sync that will actually work with my uh, Godox system so I can have wireless flash. And uh, it's just my camera of choice since I put a battery in there and see how this meter works with its lenses. I've just been totally totally taken over by this camera my uh, other choice for uh, for film for uh, for mainly the artistic purposes and and prints that will be for sale will be the Mamaya C2 Mamaya Flex C2 uh, medium format TLR so anyways that's my choice we got the uh, Q200 lens on there today and a very special film inside this camera it is sold by Lamography as uh, Lady Grey 400 now at one time this film was being marketed by Lomography. I'm pretty sure it was uh, it was uh, it was a Kodak film a T. I don't know the Kodak films too much. The TX or something like that. Tri-X. But uh, but after uh, quite a few years back, they switched to this uh, Fomapan 400. Apparently, now this is a Czech Republic film that has had the same emulsion for decades and decades. So the emulsion on this film has not changed. So that, that's why I've fallen in love with this film because it gives such a beautiful classic look that you just can't get out of any of the other films today. You're not gonna get it, it's not gonna happen unless it's this film packaged as something else. Uh, but it, the, this company is still running, like I said, the same emulsion, unique, grain pattern that it's been running for decades and decades and decades so thank goodness for that right so here we go we got a 1967 camera 1967 lens we got a we got a classic old the uh, a classic old FOMO pan uh, film in here 400 and let's see what we got today I'm taking shots of uh, uh, different things here and there just to test it out so uh, so th these won't be for art prints. I'm just testing this film out with a few other films, but uh, I'm pretty sure this is gonna be a main staple of film for me, especially if I start selling prints and stuff, you're gonna be seeing a lot of this film because I want that special classic look that this film gives. So like, subscribe, click the bell, everyone take care. More lenses showing up for this uh, camera over in the future. All the way through the year, there's one lens that is very, very expensive, so I won't let you know which one that is. But that won't be coming until next year, way next year. Anyways, like, subscribe, click the bell. Whoa, Nikkor Mad FTN, wow. You know, whew, all of a sudden it just grabbed a hold of me and it won't let go. <laughs> See you guys later. Hang loose, everyone.
Thank you.